are you too so we have some dirty stains here you guys see in the corner so we got this corner here and you got some stuff right there i don't know what it is but i'm gonna go ahead and just spray it with some super clean spray it with some super clean and then i'm gonna follow up with my steamer so i'm gonna grab my steamer here and then it's just gonna break down that dirt and stuff like that And then I'm going to wipe it with this towel. Now, I don't want to hit it with the compressor just yet because I don't want to create more of a mess. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't have that compressor going just yet. Just because it's like big chunks of stuff. So, I don't want it to start flying everywhere. Rather try to contain it in the same spot that it's in. Now I'm gonna spray it one more time, and then we'll do that again before we bring out the compressor. So now I'll bring on my compressor. And the compressor is just simply going to break it down as well. But it's just going to get like a deeper cleanse. So I'm going to turn on my vacuum now. And then we'll repeat it if we have to one more time. So we'll spray it with the steamer, spray it with our liquid, and then see what's going on. See if we're getting the results that we want to get. And I guarantee you the client would be happy with those results there. But we're going to take it a little further, of course. So we'll spray these carpets down. Now I'm going to go in with some contact steam. And all that means is just I'm going to use my triangle. All right, so I'm going to go in with some contact steam, and all that means is just I'm going to put my triangle attachment here instead of just going like this so I can actually start kind of like scrubbing the carpets out. Always go in different directions as well. That'll help you out a little bit.
and voila we have some brand new looking carpets there we go